Hey, what's up guys? So I am on my way back home from the Black Wolf Boot Camp. We had a great time in LA and uh, I wanted to share something with you about this bank run with Silicon Valley Bank. Uh, we talked about that extensively in the boot camp. And here's a couple of things you want to know about the Silicon Valley Bank run. First off, um, in the history of all bank runs, there has never been a bank run like this. This is uh, one of a kind. This has never happened before. Never before have you had a technology-based bank run where people were dumping uh, or moving their money over the phone uh, within just a few hours. Uh, this circulated to hundreds of thousands of people through Twitter. Fear is a virus that passes very quickly and it passes through technology. So this is what made this bank run really unique and really different from any other bank run. The second thing about this bank run is uh, they interviewed the uh, former chairman of the FDIC, Federal Dis Deposit Insurance Corporation, that insures deposits. And he said, I have no doubt that this is going to happen again. I don't know who, I don't know where, I don't know when or why or how, but it's going to happen again. So bank runs are going to happen. They're, they're probably going to pass laws to kind of deal with <laughs> the fact that technology can spread fear and misinformation faster than anything. And because in, in the financial system, trust is critically important. If you don't have trust, then you can have that fear sort of creep in and cause people to just lose faith in something. And when people lose faith in a financial institution, it's going to die. So this is going to be interesting to see how they evolve. They're probably going to pass a bunch of new laws. Uh, hopefully they'll enforce the laws that were already in place because Silicon Valley Bank basically took advantage of the fact that the regulators in California were not doing their job in monitoring what they were doing with people's deposits. And so effectively they were um, had what is called a, a, a duration mismatch, which caused them to be in terrible financial position. So so anyway, uh, I'll let you, I'll keep you guys posted on what's going on. Do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button, sh thumbs up, share, subscribe. My website's voicewalkins.com. You can feel free to go there and take a look at my new book. It's an Amazon bestseller, number one bestseller in the public finance category. It's called The Ten Commandments of Black Economic Power. And on my website, voicewalkins.com, you can also get access to a training I did called How to Make Money Without Working. So I'm going to get on this airplane, guys, and I'll check in with you a little bit later. Have a good day. Peace.